With so many music venues closing in the city, it's becoming harder and harder for great indie artists to find the perfect spot to perform. But this stage right here is becoming a great outlet for indie artists every Friday in the perfect place, the heart of the city. It's a nice opportunity because, you know, sometimes when you're playing more of the folk festivals, you get a certain crowd that's already kind of um, familiar with that type of music. So tonight it's, you know, you get all kinds, so it might be introducing people to something they haven't heard before that they may find that they're into. Every Friday until the end of August, a free concert built with a collection of indie artists takes place in Dundas Square. An opportunity that Megan Bunnell says is a dream come true. I think it's an incredible opportunity because it's one of those rare gems when you get to play an outdoor stage like this in the heart of our city that, you know, I feel such um, such a bond with being here for 10 years now. And I think given being Canadian, we're so, we spend eight months of the year or however many kind of in hibernation and playing in either bars or theaters or whatever it is. So to play outdoor to the open air and have it be a free concert that everyone can just walk up to do is it's a rare and special thing. Bendy Music Fridays doesn't just showcase local performers, it also showcases two Canadian graffiti artists that during the performance are inspired by the music they hear and they create one-of-a-kind art that will be showcased in the center of the square. Lindsay Dunn, City News, Toronto.